Hey, this is Presh Tullwalker. Construct a square and shade its interior in blue. Then construct four semicircles as shown. The diameter of each semicircle spans the center of the square to a corner of the square. And each of the four arcs of the four semicircles are oriented counterclockwise from their diameters. Shade the interior of each of these semicircles in white. Then shade the region that's exterior to the square but interior to the semicircles in blue. The question is if the side of the square has a length equal to 4, what is the area of the region shaded in blue? I thank the puzzle creator at cshare41 and I saw it via at wait but why all on Twitter. Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try and when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. There are many ways to solve the problem, but I will illustrate one method. Construct four line segments. Each line segment connects the center of the square to a midpoint of the square. The region between this line segment and the circular arc of the semicircle is a circular segment, and it's exactly equal to the circular segment that's outside of the square. In other words, we can move each of these circular segments outside of the square to the region that's inside the square. From here, We've just shifted the blue area, so if we solve for the blue area that remains, we'll get the original answer. We have now created four isosceles right triangles. So we just need to figure out the sum of the areas of these four triangles. This is a straightforward task. Notice that we have divided the square into eight congruent right triangles, and four of them are shaded in blue. Therefore, the area shaded in blue is exactly half of the square's area. The square's area is equal to 4 times 4, which is equal to 16. And if we take that divided by 2, we get that the blue area is equal to 8. And that's the answer. Thanks for making us one of the best communities on YouTube. See you next episode of Mind Your Decisions, where we solve the world's problems one video at a time.